In the film, um, your on-screen dad takes you to a yard sale yes. where you beg for him to buy you this mysterious wooden box. Mm -hmm. Does this at all remind you of your child like asking, like begging for you to get him something? <laughs> <laughs> well, I, I mean, I suppose, except for he just wants Thomas to train stuff. I don't know that he would pick out a, a weird box. <laughs> but yeah. Have you guys at all been to yard sales or garage sales? And if so, have you guys bought anything that's interesting? I haven't gone to a whole lot of yard sales. I mean, I think I've been to a few, but not anything as big as this one, and I haven't bought anything um, as creepy as the box. <laughs> I would hope not. No. All the stuff, I go to the garage sales. I used to go to garage sales all the time, but now I go to like salvage yards, and I usually just come home with like windows that I want to put in the house, that kind of thing. Oh, well, that's really cool. Yeah, nothing, nothing haunted at this point. <laughs> now, back over to you, there's this scene where you're going through the fridge, and you're just eating lots and lots of food. I would imagine that's a little girl's like fantasy, just eating whatever food. Did you get to pick what you ate in that scene? No, and it's and she not. She chose a piece of beef. <laughs> <laughs> it's not a little girl's fantasy to um, be eating what I was eating. Let me tell you that. But um, I had to eat. In this particular scene that you're talking about, I had to eat raw meat, like actual raw meat. And and I went into the film and they had told me, yeah, you know, there's a few scenes that you have to do some pretty extreme things. And they're like, oh, but this one, don't worry. It's not actually going to be raw meat, like as if, you know. It's going to mm -hmm. be prosciutto or something painted as raw meat. Um, and then it was about a, a few days before we were going to film that scene. And the director came up to me. He's like, oh, and you do know that it's going to be actually raw meat. And I'm like... Um, no. Like, I have to eat raw meat. And he's like, yeah. So, um, that's So much for being a vegetarian. Yeah, yeah. exactly. It was <laughs> raw meat, and I, I got to spit it out, but... Okay, well, that's good. Yeah. <laughs> it was still kind of good. I would have made her swallow it if yeah. I didn't <laughs> Now, I know Kira kind of talked about some creepy things happening on set. Did you guys experience any of these eerie feelings, and can you describe them for me, please? Mm -hmm. We experienced quite a bit. I mean, lots of light bulbs exploded. Um, when we were in the middle of like an important scene, they would just randomly explode. And what else was there? Um, like cold, eerie feelings that would go through the set um, and all the windows would be closed, all the doors, no air, air conditioning. So that was really creepy. And um, didn't all the props. Bring it home. All Bring the it props. Home. You're doing good. <laughs> all the props um, burnt down. They were in a warehouse and they were in storage. And a few days after we finished filming, uh, they all burnt down to ashes. And the Vancouver police got on it and it's un unexplainable and nobody knows what happened. Oh, wow. That's like very similar it's to really, the exorcist. Uh, yeah, it's unexplainable and really yeah. creepy. Yeah, and one last question. Um, Modest Yahoo made his um, feature film debut. How did you guys think he did? Amazing. He was such an amazing, amazing actor. I mean, this is one of, this. I think this is his first um, movie, and he did such a phenomenal j job because he, his role was pretty, um, it was pretty extravagant. He has a uh, he has a, a natural presence. Yeah, I, I for think, sure. You know, um, he's one of those guys that he doesn't have to say anything. He, he knows how to translate with his eyes. Um, a, a really a, a talented man, certainly, yeah. and he was very nervous going in as an actor. Um, mm -hmm. I met him at a little park in in downtown Vancouver when he first got there, and I went over every single one of his scenes with him, and he was super nervous. Um, really, I, I want to say sweet, but I don't know why. That's probably not a good word to use for him. Um, but he really cared a lot. You know, yeah. um, and then he showed up and, and delivered. I mean, I knew the yeah. second I saw him on a monitor that, that uh, mm -hmm. he was going to rock it out, and he did. Game, 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 game.